So last question, Liz, is what should we leave with people today? What, you know, what uh, advice or parting words? Yeah, so I, I hope that, you know, we were able to sort of make things clear about, you know, where medicine stands, and, and I'm not sure if we did or not. Uh, gene therapy, we, we just stand on the precipice of the biggest change uh, to medicine in, in the history of, of the earth, of the world, of the humankind. I really want people to look into it and see it for what it is, uh, to see how powerful it is, and yet to see how um, the, the benefits. I want them to spread the word about it. I want them to contact their legislators and say that, you know, this is the type of medicine we want. We don't mm -hmm. want to be taking pills, pills that, you know, right now, if you take a pharmaceutical for atherosclerosis, you're, you're likely to die of that very disease. It may slow it, it may ameliorate it, but what we want to do is we want to cure it. And we really need people to pioneer the effort to not only spread the word, but to insist that they have access to this kind of medicine, insist that the, the, the costs of this kind of medicine are, are driven down significantly. Yeah. Uh, you know, one company, uh, we we can we, we will start, we will do the best we can, uh, but it's going to take more than one of us. We need to have a situation where we can treat uh, people here in the U.S. under compassionate care scenario. We need the rights to access medicine for ourselves. I want you to have the right to say, I want a gene therapy. This is my body and I'll use it as I please. And, and I want the right to cure my body of disease. You know, we need all of this grassroots movement in order to make a, a really big paradigm shift in how we treat disease.